Welcome to an exploration of fertilization in humans, a fascinating process marking the beginning of life. Before we delve into the process of fertilization itself, let's understand the structure and function of the male and female reproductive systems. The male reproductive system is designed to produce, store, and transport sperm cells. It includes the testes, where sperm and testosterone are produced, the vas deferens, which carries sperm from the testes, and glands like the seminal vesicles and prostate gland, which produce fluids to nourish and transport sperm. The female reproductive system is structured to produce eggs and support the development of a new life. The ovaries produce and release eggs during ovulation. These eggs travel through the fallopian tubes, where fertilization occurs. The uterus provides a nourishing environment for the developing embryo, while the cervix and vagina serve as the pathway through which sperm enter. Each month, a mature egg, or ovum, is released from one of the ovaries in a process called ovulation. The egg travels into the fallopian tube, where it awaits the arrival of sperm for fertilization. During ejaculation, millions of sperm are deposited in the female reproductive tract. However, only a small number manage to reach the fallopian tubes, navigating through the cervix and uterus on their journey toward the egg. In the fallopian tube, the sperm finally encounters the egg. The egg is surrounded by a protective layer called the zona pellucida, which only allows one sperm to penetrate for successful fertilization. The sperm's head contains an acrosome, which releases enzymes that break down the zona pellucida. This allows a single sperm to penetrate the egg, marking the beginning of fertilization. Once inside, the sperm sheds its tail, and the nuclei of the sperm and egg move closer together. The fusion of these two nuclei forms a zygote, the first cell of a new human. To ensure only one sperm fertilizes the egg, the egg undergoes rapid changes in its membrane, preventing additional sperm from entering, a process known as polyspermy prevention. The zygote then begins dividing through mitosis, forming multiple cells as it travels down the fallopian tube to the uterus, where it will eventually implant and continue developing into an embryo. Fertilization is a complex and miraculous process, transforming two cells into a single new organism, ready for the journey of growth and development. Thank you for joining us in exploring the incredible process of fertilization. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Science Animations for more engaging videos on biology and science topics. Drop a comment below if you have any questions or topics you'd like to see covered. See you in the next video.